Welcome back. This is KTN Prime. Now, the late Bomet Governor Dr. Joyce Laboso will be buried on Saturday at her Fort Tenan home in Koru in the county of Kisumu. According to Energy CS, Charles Kateru is the chair of the Berry Organizing Committee. Laboso's memorial service will be conducted on Thursday at the All Saints Cathedral here in Nairobi before the body is flown to Bomet County. Here is Jeff Kirui with the details. This Thursday morning, first, there will be a church service at All Saints Cathedral. And then from 2 o'clock, which runs up to 2 o'clock, and then thereafter, the body will be moved to Bomet, where there will also be church services running all the way to Friday. Uh, Friday, again, there will be church service, church service, funeral service in Bomet. And then via sortie. And then finally for Tanan, where the burial will take place on Saturday. Then the body will be in Bomet uh, Stadium yeah. throughout the night Thursday. for the people of uh, Thursday, <coughs> for the people of Bomet. Because Joy served as a member of parliament for sortie for two terms. She was the governor uh, for Bomet, so that is why they have been given uh, quite some long hours up to Friday afternoon. That's when the body now will be moved to Fortenan. That is where the burial will take place. It is in Moroni. It is a border between... Uh, the place is just at the border. So uh, Fortenan and Kipkelion and, 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 and Moroni constituency. It's uh, just... Uh, yeah. It's uh, where she's married. Uh, that is... Uh, the place called Kadeng, Kadenge. Let's now take you live to the county of Bomet, where KTN's Alan Ochanda has been following the preparations for the final journey of the late Joyce Laboso. Alan, good evening. I know it is a, a somber mood in the county of Bomet, but just uh, paint for us a picture of uh, what's happening there in terms of the send-off as well as transition in the county government. Good evening to you, Ben Kitin. Indeed, uh, here in uh, Bomet County, it's been drizzling in the last uh, 30 minutes, but uh, the weather is now calm. As you can see behind me, there's a crowd uh, that is just a mill here. Uh, quite somber. There's a, a cloud, a dark cloud that's just uh, engulfed this uh, uh, county, the great uh, county of uh, Bomet. But remember that, as you rightly put, is that uh, in Nairobi, the funeral committee uh, that is actually steering the uh, burial of uh, the, uh, the, the the late governor Joyce Laboso Cherono is led by uh, Kiricho Senator. Ad that's uh, Charles Keter, but here in uh, Bomet, uh, back at home, it's led by the Deputy Governor Hillary, Hillary Barchok, who was actually indicated to us that uh, the burial plans are upbeat and the, uh, and the body will actually be flown here in Bomet for public viewing here before it's uh, flown to Koru Kisumu County in her matrimonial home to be uh, so that the remains can be entered right there. We also talked to the deputy governor about uh, an impending uh, uh, vacuum power vacuum in the county of Bomet and he's dispelled such rumors or rather, rather such fears saying that uh, when the doctor when Dr. Loboso was actually ailing uh, abroad he was in charge of the county uh, in acting uh, capacity, but uh, and so he continues to do so in an acting capacity before he's uh, sworn in as uh, the as the, as the substantive governor of the county of Bomet. And so we are following up the, the story as it unfolds uh, here in uh, Bomet County so that we could just uh, give our viewers the faster hand information here. Kitili. Many thanks, Alan. Alan Ochanda will be keeping an eye on us uh, what will be happening on Friday.